federal authorities anticipated Caso's assistance in bringing the corrupt detectives to justice, eagerly counting on his cooperation as a pivotal witness in the forthcoming racketeering and murder trial of Vincent Chin Higante, the influential head of the Genovese crime family. However, Caso's time in a specialized prison unit for cooperating witnesses was marred by the commission of fresh crimes and the subsequent unmasking of a few deceptive fabrications. As a result, he never had the opportunity to testify in any court proceedings. Ultimately, in the summer of 1998, Gaspipe was condemned to a lifelong sentence without the possibility of parole, a penance that would consume the remainder of his days. Sadly, the tale of Anthony Gaspipe Caso came to an end on December 15, 2020, when he succumbed to complications arising from the devastating coronavirus. While confined within the confines of a federal penitentiary in Arizona, Caso passed away at the age of 78, as confirmed by the Federal Bureau of Prisons, leaving behind a legacy entwined with the darkest corners of organized crime.